Right, folks, me and the June Junie have come to a place called Ashby de la Zoch. Zouch. Ashby de la Zouch. Now, there's some old boy in a Beach Hyundai, car. and I'm a bit worried because he can't place one foot in front of the other, and I'm terrified he's going to run into the transit. Oh, for fuck's sake. Can you hear the revs? Can you hear the revs? Like a wild fucking stallion. And a there he goes, there he goes. We're He's all right. It. He's We're made right. it. We're all right, folks. No need to panic. We have come. I'll just show you him. Look. Here he is. Look. There he goes. There he goes. Like a thief in the night. Um. Right, folks, Mia and June Juni have come to the market town of Ashby Dalla Zooch. 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 Sounds like a fucking Star Wars character, doesn't it? Darth Zooch. What do you reckon? June's watching some of Tom fucking. Yeah, sorry, I was watching us do fake takes. Anyway, we've come to Ashby Dalla Zooch, as I've already told you about three times Zooch. now. Zooch. And um, yeah, we've I've told you about four fucking cards. You'll now. get fucking told in a minute. You'll mm. be over my knee with a slapped arse. Oh, better not say that. Some people might take offence of oh, me imagine having Imagine the views. Imagine the views. June getting a bum slapped. I've, um, I've burnt myself. Now she's burnt herself. I've, I've sent her all in a dither. I ain't. I've got all chips all, all on my clean jeans. Oh, oh for fuck's sake, June. You fucking need one of them bibs with a like a pecan. Not a pecan. Pelican. Pelican. Uh, right, we have come to Ashbet and we have walked around the charity shops. Uh, not a lot. We do like a charity shop, don't we, June? We do like to... Oh. I'm having a mare. For fuck's sake. Do you want something to put over you? No, it's too late now. And uh, anyway, we've done the charity shots. We've walked around town. It's very warm today. Well, it was warm, weren't it, when we came out? We yeah. took the dogs a walk around Presswold. Um, and uh, that's where they held the inquiry to the uh, M1 air crash many years ago. And um, it was quite warm. We've come to Ashby. And um, I don't know if I mentioned we've come to Ashby. And. Um, it gone chilly, didn't it, June? You had to wear me Adidas. I did. She had to wear the Adidas. Anyway, uh, the, I've, we've, I'm a bit peckish. Uh, June was starving. Uh, she was wasting away. And um, I says, well, I know. Let's have some fish and chips. I've got the camera. We'll have some fish and chips. And I'll review them. So I've typed it in on the old, uh, the old fucking touch screen. And uh, I found a place called Nick's Fish Bar. Uh, he is on Derby Road next to the Bridge Place... Numbers two and four at the front, six and eight at the rear. And we like it at the rear, don't we? <laughs> what the fuck's that all about? Oh, you could play with that, couldn't you? Um, yes. And he's got pucker pies. So, I've popped in. Uh, they're doing a meal deal thing uh, at dinner times. You can have a mini fish, chips and peas, which is what I've had. Is that a mini fish? It looks quite big. That does look quite a big fish, doesn't it? Mm, it looks like it looks like a penis, doesn't it? it? Looks like a cock. Looks like a fucking nine foot cock and balls, man, doesn't it? Are you laughing? Yeah. Uh, June's had a fish. Uh, June's had a fritter, potato fritter, um, and she's got chips and curry sauce. So uh, the idea is, folks, is that I devour this, uh, give you my opinion, and uh, well, we I'm go from there. Supposed to be eating it. it's batter. Oh fuck! It's batter, isn't it? Blokes walk by, he smelt fish and chips. Right, folks, we all know the words. Uh, this cost a fiver. That was £3.40. Which ain't too bad, is it? Uh, let's let's tuck in, folks. Let's, let's, oh, look at this. Look at that. Get in there. Let's tuck in. Mmm, nice mm. and crunchy. Mmm. Mmm, that is good. What is it, cod or? Cod. Um, the best thing was that, you know when you go to some chip shops and they're just like, they do that, don't they? What, With the salt, salt and vinegar. vinegar. Yeah. And they don't really put any on. The old dear behind the counter, I don't mean to say old dear, but old dear behind the counter, she chucked fucking loads on. Absolutely brilliant. Because I said to her, you know what you're doing there, don't you? Because like, you, when I go into a chip shop, I normally say, oh, put a bit more on, put a bit more on. Because what happens is all the, the salt gets, and the vinegar gets soaked up and you don't really taste it. But, uh, no, she knew what she was doing. She goes, I've been here 42 years. 
And he said it's about time they fucking let you out then. And then she told me it was a part-time job many years ago when her daughter was at university. Oh, that's nice. Okay. The thing is, though, I go onto the website. Nice big lumps of chunky white fish. I go onto the website and I've just picked the best chip shop that I see around here. Mm. And it seems that there's only two in Ashby. There's this one. And the fish bar on the main drag. But there's nowhere to park the van and I weren't going to walk all the way up there to walk back to the van. So basically Nick has got parking outside for about eight vehicles. It looks like they have a seating area as well. It's not up at the minute, but they've got gazebos well, outside. The chips are good, aren't they, Jim? We are really good. Yeah. They are really good. But I always think that you you can't have fish and chips wrapped and taken home. No. And eat them because no. it's not the same. You've got to eat them straight out the shop. Mm. Out the what used to be paper but or off a tray now, aren't you? Yeah, it's off a tray now, these healthy bloody trays. Mm. We're all banging on about climate change, yet we're all eating off these polystyrene things. Which is not Nick's fault, because obviously he's had to buy what he can buy and peas are good. The peas are good because they've got hard peas in them. Do you know what I mean? They're not too mushy. These are like the peas that my <laughs> granny Dora used to do. Well, we do them, don't we? Oh, yeah, we do. Soaky peas at home. They're not too mushed up. They're not too... They're not like a pea that's all... Well, sometimes you can overcook them quite because I overcooked some the other day. Oh, that was funny, weren't it, June? You cooked some funny peas the other day. They were funny, funny peas. Funny peas. And it was just like soup. Mm. Put too much water in. Well, we did actually guess, didn't we? Mm. I'll tell you what, these are bloody good, aren't they? Motorbike, got road works up. And uh, everybody's queuing. There's the bus. And then some bloke on a motorbike just goes straight to the front of the fucking 29A queue. 29A to Swad. Yeah, Swad, Pete. Pete lives in a Swad. And the brothers who I did the uh, podcast with, they're on there, they live in Swad. Mm. i tell you what, folks. The butter's really good, isn't it? The butter got, is good. I've got, I've got butter on my um, potato fritter. Yeah, I knew you'd like a potato fritter, June. Mm. I, don't, I shouldn't have it, though, really. I'll pay for it later. But sometimes it's just worth it, worth mm. the pain. Mm. Bit like childbirth. Childbirth cost me a fucking fortune. Oh, well, thank God we only had one. Yeah. Mm. These are hot, really hot. This is quality. Yeah, it's nice. It is nice. Just I tell you what, it ain't. It ain't complicated to do fish and chips, but people sometimes do. I, I, th I think it's. Um... There's an art to it, isn't there? There is definitely an art to owning a fish and chip shop. Yeah, I think it's a bit like pastry making. You're either good at it or you're shit. Yeah. I fall into the shit category. Mm. Co-op the... are very good at it. I'll tell you what else she did. You know when she put the salt and vinegar on? Mm. She put the salt and vinegar on the chips and the peas. Right? Mm. And then she put the fish on and then put the salt and vinegar on the fish as well. Yeah. You've got to layer it up. You've got to layer it up. June's right. You've got to, you know what I mean? And that is how you should do it. You shouldn't just like put a pile everything on and then chuck a bit of salt and vinegar on the top. I'm fucking impressed with these. Yeah, very nice. Mm. Really, really nice. This is... I don't know whether it's me. I doubt if it's just you. Hey, but chippies seem to have upped the game a bit. Yeah. Late because... Yeah, right they have. Here, they went really rubbish yeah. for about 10 years, didn't they? Yeah, it's like they will chuck any old shit out. Yeah. But weren't there all that thing with the fish at one time? You, you, couldn't, you, try, couldn't. you couldn't buy a cod, could you? No, we had the cod wars, didn't we? I'm getting hot sat here. Yeah, I am at all. What I'm going to do, I'm going to 
well I'm not gonna I want to finish this video I like to devour as much as I can on the screen so then people know that it's really good quality because if you don't people might say oh you turned that off a bit early why didn't you eat at all and because I don't know. This is just good quality fish and chips, isn't it? Hold on, baby, I'll open the door. Do you want me to open the window? Yeah. There we oh, go. Oh, a bit of wind coming through. And I'll tell you something else they got, right? The chips aren't big. Sometimes you get chips now that they're about that fucking long, isn't they? And you can't get them out of your tray. There's people now watching this video and they're going, BVM's dash cam makes the same noise as mine. Right, I've had enough. Oh yeah. Oh, cool. Right, well in that case, I'm going to turn this camera off. Did you want to try a bit of fish? No, thanks. Hmm. Could this is... a cup of tea now. Well, we'll go and get one back, shall we? Oh, we'll have a gym instead. Yeah. We'll have a gym. We'll go and stop at the uh, Queen's Head at Belton on the way home. Um, if it's open, we're not sure. It's yet. open. Is it? Yeah. Um, yeah. After you've watched this video, folks, if you go over to the Queen's Head at Belton, you might see us there. No, the won't, you silly boy. <laughs> uh, so, Nick's Fish Bar. Absolutely spot on, um, well impressed, in Ashby, Derby Road, go over there, uh, tell them BVM sent you. I probably won't come over here again and eat fish and chips because it's too far for us to travel, but you never know, do you? Oh, I don't know, because you can't often nip into Ashby. Yeah, you we nip into to Ashby. we four much today, queuing outside oh. every frigging shop. Yeah, it's a nightmare. Boris, get your fingers sorted and pull it out. Uh, all right, folks, get yourself over to Nick's Fish Bar and enjoy their fish and chips. Oh. Laters.